A Samsung premiere event scheduled for June 20th talks Galaxy and Ative. More details emerge on an HTC phablet in development, and Nokia executives keep talking about a light field camera for future Lumias. I'm Jaime Rivera, and yeah, that date on that Samsung premiere event is just too obvious. This is Pocket Now Daily. Let's start today off talking about the lame news. We all saw the white Nexus 4 at Google I.O. It's not a state secret. The product was there available. Nobody could take it home, but we all know that it exists and still we're seeing some more leaked renders of the device. We still don't know a specific date when it will be launched, but we all assume that it's going to happen on June 10th. You know, that same date when WWDC is happening for Apple and apparently Android 4.3 is also going to be happening. We still don't have a confirmation, but it's just funny to still see these leaked renders. Let's see how that goes. Now let's move over to Nokia as their company executives are talking more about the option for light field cameras. You know, that technology where you can take a photograph with the camera and then you can reselect where you want the camera to focus within the software, not necessarily taking a photo again. We all saw that with the Lytro cameras. It's not new anymore and executives keep talking about the fact that it is coming in the future of the Lumias. And apparently Windows Phone is equipped to deal with this new technology. So stay tuned. This could probably be part of the EOS project that everybody's waiting for probably by the end of this year. Up next, we've got more rumors of a phablet version of the HTC One. We all remember that the HTC One was called the M7 as a code name, and then the new desire is the M4, and now this code name for this phone is the T6. And I don't know if 6 could stand for a screen size because the M7 doesn't stand for the size of the screen of the HTC One, except for the 4.7 inch display, but still. Apparently this device will have a couple of variants, not just one LTE variant, so it'll probably be a device that will be launched on all cameras carriers. Stay tuned. Right now, all we have is the T6 code name. It could probably ring a bell eventually. We'll keep you posted. Now let's talk about some more rumors. You know that Galaxy S4 Mini that has not been launched and at least four of you out there are still waiting for. You know, this device is now being mentioned on the Samsung website apparently as a leak and it'll bring a QHD display with a dual core Exynos processor. Probably some of you out there will like this product. It does seem interesting. I mean, a 4.3 inch display is something that a lot of people are looking for. Not everybody wants a jumbo phone. But sadly, with the fact that the Galaxy S3 Mini is not getting any newer versions of Android, I don't know if I'm going to recommend that S4 Mini, so stay tuned. Let's see what happens with this one. And finally, for the interesting news of the day, Samsung is sending out press invitations for an event to happen on June 20th in London, and it rings uh, Samsung Galaxy products and Atif products. And we all know about the Galaxy S4 Active that's been rumored, and also the Galaxy S4 Zoom as well. And we also know that the Atif lineup, you know, the Windows Phone and the Windows products, haven't really taken off, so let's see what the company has in store for us. So that leads me to the question of the day. What are your predictions for this event? What do you think that Samsung's going to be launching? I mean, it's happening so close to WWDC that it begs to wonder what the company's bringing. But whatever they bring out, as long as it's not the Galaxy S4 Mini and just the S4 Mini, I don't care what they launch. So stay tuned. We'll definitely be at the event covering it live. And of course, if you want an earlier scoop of everything that's happening in the smartphone and tablet world, make sure you follow us on PocketNow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can also follow me on Twitter at Jaime underscore Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We will see you tomorrow.